What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out Jaspie's 18 box bounty hunter mixer. It's a football mixer, random teens, where your chances to win some break credit, guys. So we've it's been a while since we've done some of these bounty hunter mixers, but they're always fun and exciting, guys. So again, everybody gets a random team in the NFL. Just remember, no con uh, veteran commons will ship. And the bounties that you guys want to hit, guys, if you guys want to win some break credit in this break is if you hit a card numbered 4 out of 10, has to be exactly 4 out of 10 serial numbered in this break, we will give you $410 in break credit. Just like that. There's no max winner, so we pull 10 of these, well, we're going to give over $4,000 in break credit. So the beauty of this, guys, is that it doesn't matter what team you have. It's different years, so that's the beauty of it. Um, if as long as you get a serial number four out of ten, that bounty will be hit and it'll be given out to that customer that has that team. The second bounty is if we hit a one on one card, uh, we will give you hundred dollars in break credit. No max winners. Printing plates do count, and any serial number one on one counts. So base card, printing plate. As you can see, it's a little example. Your plates and patches usually has a printing plate, <laughs> so we already know guaranteed at least one winner is going to be there. Uh, and again, we'll give as many as those out as well. No max winners. The third bounty is if you hit an autograph number to 50 or less of a former number one overall pick in the NFL, we'll give you $75 in break credit. So it has to be under 50, the serial number, and it has to be a former NFL number one overall pick. And the list of draft picks are here. If you click the link, it'll pop open a little Wikipedia page and tell you which draft picks from as far as 1936 down to, to current year. So you got that there. And the last bounty is if we hit an autograph number to 25 or less of a former Heisman Trophy Award winner. We'll give you fifty dollars in break credit. No max entries either. And the list of Heisman Trophy winners are here as well, from 1935 all the way down to the current Heisman Trophy winner. And again, this mixer is a pretty nice one, guys. 18 boxes includes a 2017 Vertex, all the way down to 13 certified. So that's a cool little bounty hunter mixer there, guys. And uh, here are the customers that bought in straight up from Wesley down to George Last Spot Mojo. And if you won spots, an absolute one and two, you were also in. We gave away six in each, I believe. So, good luck. Everybody gets a random team. Let's do it. Roll. We got it five and a five ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Matt Buckler, Donna Robert. Ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Saints down to the Denver Broncos. So, Matt, you have the Saints. Paul with the Dolphins. Uh, Dargan with the Titans. Mark L. with the Patriots. Paul, you have the Falcons. Jake with the Chargers. George with the Lions and 49ers. Chad with the Bengals. Tyler with the Eagles. Nick with the Browns. Wesley, you have the Ravens. Adam with the Redskins. Robert with the Jaguars. Sean with the Texans. Paul with the Bucks. George with the Jets. Asa with the Vikings. Juan, you have the Pittsburgh Steelers. George with the Colts. Asa with the Bears. Nick with the Giants. Wesley with the Packers. Jeff with the Seahawks. Daniel, you have the Cowboys, Nick with the Rams, Matt Buckler with the Chiefs, Jason with the Cardinals, Ryan P. with the um, Bills, Joe Haynes with the Raiders, George with the Panthers, Robert Throne with the Denver Broncos. Alright guys, anybody want to trade? This is the time. Alright, and Rick just got the last three in Obsidian. So Obsidian is now sold out.
Uh, if I miss it early, but if you get hit multiple times, you have a single card. Yeah, I mean, I guess that could happen, right? You get a 4 out of 10, uh, Joe Burrow. <laughs> then, yeah, you would get that bounty and this bounty. The Heisman out of 25 or under 25, you know? So, yeah, you would, you would get both or all bounties if that was the case. Yeah, so Jake is proposing a Steelers for a Chargers. If not, we'll close it. What's up, Tyler? So, yeah, uh, you could hit multiple bounties technically on one card if that was the case. Um, never thought of it that way, but if it does happen, yeah. Yeah, no, there's a, I mean, yeah, there's, there's a plenty of Heisman Trophy winners out there, and there's plenty of number one overall picks out there. So, that's kind of cool, right? Because think about it. Let's say it's a former number one overall pick that didn't really pan out, but for some reason, you know, we, we get his autograph here, and it's out of 50 or out of 25, like, you know, you hit the bounty. Then that makes it worth it, right? All right, so Juan denied that one. Last trade proposals. Steelers for Seattle. If not, I'm closing at one. Let me know. Remember, there's also multiple years worth of stuff here, guys. Dating back to all the way to 2013. So, 2013 here. There's a handful of 2016 boxes. Uh... Wait, Juan's well, saying yes, but Jeff, are you canceling it? Are you just opting out of the trade then again? <laughs> Let me know. You see then, guys. Think of what you got. Maybe try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo takes effect. Yeah, Ross just got a spot in the gem in baseball mixer, so getting much closer now, guys. You still have to do that filler, but by you guys inching away and grabbing those spots straight up, that definitely helps out to fill the breaks. All right, and here are all the 18 boxes as well. Kind of from heavy base, lower end to the middle, to the higher end, nicer stuff there. So. I guess let's go with some of the heavier stuff yeah we got a little NFL player of the day Panini nah. and we'll Nick put it up here so good, good time to unveil it right here for the, for the football mixer
Baker Mayfield, <laughs> Of these are just gonna be base cards so we'll just skim through them i think the rookie stuff will be like right here towards the middle end guys man jeez Josh Allen right there Chuck Penny Damn Bill's about to die guys Oh, about a Yannick? <laughs> Barkley rookie. You got a number, DJ Chark. I honestly thought the Eagles were going to pull out that Yannick trade deal, but it wasn't really much, but I don't think the Eagles have enough uh, cap space to work with that for the upcoming years, especially if he wants a, wants a contract extension. Oh, that's right. I forgot Leonard Fournier got released this morning. <laughs> I don't know, man. I, I, I thought I, I thought I'd seen that the coach or GM of your guys it was just like, we've been tr we tried to trade. A fifth, the sixth, the seventh. Nobody wanted them. <laughs> at the end, at the end, they just like, I guess we gotta get rid of them. I 
I seen a, I thought I seen a tweet too actually. It reminds me. It was like the guy's Jaguar jersey collection. It was like, alright, well, Bortles is gone. It's alright. I got I forget who it was. I got Jalen Ramsey jersey. Jalen Ramsey gets traded. That's okay. I still got Yannick. Or sorry, I still got yeah, I still got Yannick. Gets traded. And then today, Fournette getting released. Alright guys, not really autographs in here, just some numbered cards and rookies I guess, but you do get a lot of cards, and they'll be separated as well. These are just base, this is the last little stack of potential rookies and numbered cards. Treadwell, Jimmy Armstrong. Award, Tom Barkley, guys. Ah, there you go. I know, Colin. I feel you, man. It's it's rough. That's okay, man. It's not, it won't be like that forever. They'll get they'll, they'll get some new people you'll fall in love with. See that's that's the crazy part, Colton. Is that's like in a span of like four years too, right? Like three years. That's not like you know you you had one for like ten years already, and that guy's gone. You know. You guys, do you think so? You don't think they're gonna give Garner a shot? And just go out and just get Trevor Lawrence or something? Steven Jackson. And we got Marquis Goodwin. It's a 99. There you go. For the Bills. Uh, 25 out of 99. And also, guys, I want to make sure. I only hit one serial number card so far in the first box, right? It was 16 out of 99. Remember, it has to be 4 out of 10. Former Heisman Trophy winner, former number one overall pick, and has to match the auto and the numbering as well. Remember, guys, if I, if I, if I forget that, you guys try to catch it as well. Kenny Vaccaro to 4.99, and we got a Jonathan Franklin 87 out of 99. Marcus Wheaton.
Matt Schaub. And whoa, we got our printing plate 101. 12 out of 99. And we got a one on one Spectrum yellow plate autograph of Jamal Taylor. And that is Dolphins. So who has the Dolphins? All right, so again, if you hit any one on one card in this break, we'll give you a hundred dollars a break there are no max winners. Printing plates count, any serial number one on one card counts. So there we go, we hit one bounty. 100 bucks being given away to the Dolphins. And uh, Dolphins is Paul Chung. So we'll do that at the end of the break. I'm going to just leave these to the corner so we can see, count how many bounties we've hit throughout the break. So there you go. I mean, the beauty of these bounties, guys, is that I'm sure Paul Chung really wanted a Jamal Taylor one-on-one -on -one printing plate autograph. You know? And that, uh, <laughs> that turned out to be 100 bucks. Archivius Mingo and Stefan Taylor. Leather and laces, 15 out of 25. A big bad. Alrighty. So there you go. Let's go with this box here. And then after that, guys, a lot of these will be pretty light, ba light uh, base wise, besides the leads. And again, this will go by college rules. So, whatever team they're currently on now. So, like this old Dell Beckham Jr. will be going to the uh, Browns. Yeah, I hope so too, Colin, if you're still here. Sorry, it's a senior comment. I really feel that Minshew does have that kind of uh, magic, you know, Minshew magic mania that you want in that you want in your quarterback, you know. Uh, Richard, if it sold out, yeah, it must have sold out while I was breaking this. So that's probably why it's not on the Google Doc. So I'll go through orders and see who sold it out once I'm done with this. So it'll take me about an hour, but I'm sure it'll be there. Yeah, if Obsidian is sold out, guys, we'll go through orders and then that'll probably be our next break. Remember, the baseball mixture is getting really close. The basketball mixture is getting really close. Um, so, essentially, we do all three mixtures tonight, guys. I said, if I'm here till almost midnight like it was yesterday, we still have plenty of time. A little over eight hours. Menzel. Wow, that would have been a big auto back in the day. It was Johnny Football. Rookie autograph. And again, this will go by college rules. So, team he's currently on or team he played for the longest if he's out of the NFL. 
which I believe that should still be going to the Browns. Um, I don't think he played anywhere else, really. I know he played in the, what, Canadian Football League? And, so that FYI, that is a Heisman Trophy winner autograph, but, remember, the Heisman Trophy winner autograph, I believe, has to be, uh, what is that? 25 or less. This one is not numbered, so it would not count as a bounty. But, well, Johnny Manziel, though. Yeah, and he really just played with Cleveland, really. So, give that to the Browns right there. And that'll go to Nick. Yeah, Mark, that's true, man. I mean, typically Oregon is not your typical pro-style offense, so that's why there's a lot of talent on their teams, but it doesn't transition to the NFL. You know, running back-wise, I think one that never really panned out that I wish did was LaMichael James. I just think he went to a bad situation with the 49ers. I don't think the 49ers really used him. Didn't really use him to the way he, they should have. You know, he got drafted right right that year when the 49ers went to the Super Bowl. But it's like they didn't really need him, and they didn't really use him the way I would have used him, you know? But, um, yeah, Black Mamba, uh, Danny Warfield, uh, Anthony Thomas, I mean, he's he's actually still stuck around out of, out of all those running backs. You know, another running back actually played with my Eagles that was from Oregon, Kenyon Barner. He was really, really good. He actually has stuck around, too. Won a Super Bowl with the Eagles. Was a kick returner and, like, a third-string running back. And actually made some plays in the Super Bowl. But Anthony Thomas is still sticking around. But uh, I definitely think LaMichael well, James should have been used differently. Um, but I think I, I still follow LaMichael well, James on Twitter, actually. And he actually opened up, like, a burger joint in, like, I think Portland or somewhere in Oregon. Like Killer Burger, I believe it's called. I don't know if any of you guys tried that if you're in the Oregon area, but they say it's really, really good. So I'm glad he's ventured off into something else. Yeah, not a lot of great ones. I mean, Jonathan Stewart, of course, was kind of the one that paved the way over there, too. He had a pretty long career. He played over 10 years. Carolina Panthers. Eric Zier. Actually, one quarterback that actually has done pretty well, but not in the NFL, has been uh, Jeremiah Masoli. I don't know if you remember him back in, like, what, 2008, 2010? What's up, Gustavo? This is the 18-box Bounty Hunter Mixer. Yeah, we've hit one bounty so far, guys. Paul got a one-on-one printing plate for Miami. I'm sure you really wanted this Jamal Taylor, but... Hundred dollars, boom. Yeah, Jeremiah Masoli actually is still playing in the a in the Canadian Football League, and pretty well. I think he plays for the uh, what is the team that Manziel tried to play on? I forget which one it is. Oh, nice, Mark. Oh, that's right, that's right. You are from Hawaii, huh? Nice. I still think Mario. I don't know, man. I just feel like Mario is going to be on a mission this year. I think. By halfway through the season, he'll take over for Carr. <laughs> I don't know. I, I really think John Gruden brought him in because I think he believes that he can still play. And like I said, we look at his stats the last couple years he's been there with Tennessee. It wasn't bad at all. Dude's had to deal with coaching changes, offensive corner changes, like every single year up until like the last two, right, of his first five years in the year in the league. So, I don't know. I think, uh, I think he'll get a shot over the Oakland. And Ben Molina autograph. 
I really love Justin Herbert, though. I really think uh, out of the quarterbacks that have come out of Oregon, I think he will do uh, pretty good if he gets the sh if he gets the shot at with uh, the Chargers. All right, elite. Nice, MG. Says your second one on one. Nice. As I can for you guys, but really would like to hit that four out of ten bounty. That'd be awesome. Oh yeah, I, I always think about that all the time. I remember that yesterday when we were talking about it. If Dennis Dixon didn't get injured and tore his ACL that 2007 year, he probably was going to win the Heisman. Oregon was most likely going to go undefeated and play for the national championship. And I'm not saying they would have won, but who knows, right? But tore his ACL against Arizona. He ended up losing that game. Still gets drafted, I think, like in the second or third round to the Steelers, but never really the same. But I think that was like his second or third ACL tear, I believe. I think he already had a little bit of injury problems at Oregon. I think it was the second one. But, yeah, man, I mean, that would have been crazy. All right, 84 to 99, Chris Carson. Swagger, little Drew Locke. Out of, uh... Star status, Derrick Henry to 349. Grant Delpit to 799. Aaron Jones to 399. Four out of ten, any one on ones, and I believe. There's actually two other ones, actually. The other two doesn't matter what the serial number is. It just has to be numbered 50 or less. So as long as it's numbered 1 of 50, 1 of 25, 1 of 10, 1 of 15, anything under 50 or less of a former number one overall pick in the NFL, you win $75. And then anything under 25 or less for a Heisman Trophy winner, uh, you win $50 in break credit. Darrington Evans. Pen Pals. So we actually, I mean, if there wasn't no numbering for Heisman Trophy winners, we actually would have got one for Johnny Manziel autograph we got out of that conference grades. But since it has to be numbered 25 or less, it did not count. Out of 94, Finucci. Cooper Cups at 399. 41 out of 8900 rugs. Drew Lock 92 out of 399. Thirty-two out of seventy-five. Christian McCaffrey, spellbound. Little Bryce Perkins to seven ninety-nine, and Duvarney to three ninety-nine. And we got Joshua Kelly, number ninety-nine out of one ninety-nine, turn of the century. Gonna go to the Chargers. All right, guys. 
guys. So there you go. Let's go with flash football. Again, this will go by the checklist as well on group break checklist. First one we got is Reggie Corbin. That's 10 out of 15. This is actually a good chance to get one of those 4 out of 10s. Usually these are lower serial numbers. KJ Hill, not number. Flash of Brilliance. Joshua Kelly, just got one of his autographs. How to go to the Chargers. We got a Khalil Tate, pretty good quarterback at Arizona, but I think he, not a quarterback now, right? I think he, tra I think he changed positions. Twenty six out of thirty five. And the last one is a DeAndre Swift. Wow, <laughs> I almost got it, guys. Four out of five. We need four out of ten, though. That's pretty close. There you go. All right, next one. Let's go signature series. All right, we got Gino Atkins, elusive ink. We got Muhammad Wilkerson. It doesn't really matter to me, Gustavo, honestly. I like both. I think both have its perks. Instagram's pretty easy to sprig anywhere. But I think you get a little bit better video quality here and bigger uh, camera to use from. Hopefully Instagram were to like eventually change some of its ways you can stream. You could potentially stream like on a camera and stuff. Through an app. I'm pretty sure you can actually. Alright, there you go. Let's go with um, some certified. Dobson, little relic, ninety one out of one forty nine. Out of nine ninety nine. The Rick Rogers to nine ninety nine. Well, Zach Ertz to two fifty. New generation for the Eagles. We got Romanowski, ninety nine. We got a little Michael Vick, ninety four out of a hundred. Nice. This
This is this is what you want to get when you guys open up 2013 products. A little 44 out of 499 jersey auto of DeAndre Hopkins. Houston Texans going to Sean. Very very nice. A little D Hop. A little Malcolm Floyd. Gino. All right, let's go 19 certified. So you guys got Heat or Bucks. Number, ooh, wow, we almost got the four out of ten right here, guys. Rise of the rise of the banner, two out of ten. Lawrence Taylor for the Giants. And we're getting a little tease now. Four out of five, now two out of ten. We're getting there, guys. We got certified potential of Chester Rogers. Ninety-three out of uh, one forty-nine. Three ninety nine. Terry Beckner. And wow, look at that. A Dwayne Haskins. That's eight out of one ninety nine, little three color patch and autograph. Right there for the Redskins. Or Washington football team, sorry. Adam K. Out of 25, Tim Brown. Parrish Campbell, new generation. Twenty four out of fifty. Yante Johnson. Let's go black gold and then we'll go 2020 certified after. Right, we got 14 out of 100. That's Jim Kelly. We got a 199, or sorry, out of 100, Jeremy Langford. We got a little Zeke Elliott, a little gold prospecting, 299. Three out of 99. Kevin Green, 73 out of 91, gold strike auto. For the Rams, winner Nick, and we got Devonte Booker. Little Jared Goff, twenty-five out of one oh nine or one hundred actually. We got John Elway. We got a quad relic that features 
Jared Goff, Carson Wentz, Christian Hackerbert, and Paxton Lynch. 65 out of 249, so that'll be a randomizer. Let's see who gets that. Let's see, Rams, that would be uh, Nick, Eagles, Tyler, uh, Broncos, Robert Throne, and Jets, George. We got John Hanna, 134 out of 189. Uh, we probably would have given it to the team that wins the randomizer, MTG. Just like we would have if it was like a random number block team. If like the random number block team was the Eagles and they won the randomizer, then whoever had the serial number would go there. So that's probably how it would have went. Unless we just divided four ways, but I'm assuming that we just have to randomize and see who actually won. And ooh, wow, Michael Thomas, sizable signatures rookie jersey. There you go. Very nice. It's going to go to the Saints. Matt Buckler. There you go. Hopefully they still have these. Maybe they like little Michael Thomas. <laughs> You're doing a lot of what ifs, MTG. <laughs> doing a lot of what ifs. I think it had to be four out of ten in the break. <laughs> Stanley. Thirteen out of twenty five is Zach Moss. And we got Parrish Campbell, twenty five out of ninety nine. Gabriel Davis, little three color patch kind of sticking out there, fifteen out of ninety nine. Off to four ninety nine. DJ Dallas. Cooper Cup to four ninety nine. DJ Moore, Lavisca. And Jonathan Taylor, 32 out of 199. All right, guys. So pretty much whatever's remaining, guys, is some nice higher end stuff. That will be breaking. Let's say we'll do the Panini one after this, then Gold Standard, then Plates and Patches, Spectra, Vertex, and then we'll leave the. Remember, be that stuff to be last.
All right, Jordan Matthews, 48 out of 49 for the Eagles. We got a redemption. Braden Cooks, cinematic signatures, Jade. Now, 2016, Braden Cooks, that still should have been, what, Saints still, I believe? That's where he went first. Look at the checklist really quick. Oh, Brandon. That was Brandon. Yeah, Saints, and it was card number 27, yeah. And uh, little Jade would have been tw 25 uh, out of 25. So Saints with that one. Little Nola. We got uh, Colby, listen B. Listen, Linda. Connor Cook. That is 11 out of 25. I don't think Connor Cook was a Heisman Trophy winner. Or a former number one overall pick. And double feature, Von Miller and DeMarcus Ware. Let's go for any one. We're good, guys. Sorry. Wow. What a mixer. You got yourself a 59 out of 99 Kyler Murray. Little patch auto from Panini 1. And Jason W. with the Arizona Cardinals. Now, Kyler Murray was a former Heisen Trophy winner. So he does fit that. But it has to be 25 or less. And... He would have fit the 50 or less one, right? Former number one overall pick. But this is out of 99. God damn it. We could have got two bounties in one. There you go. I'm sure you'll still be happy walking away with a little RP of Kyler Murray. So there you go. So 25 or less for a Heisman Trophy winner. Or 50 or less for a number one overall pick. It's still very nice. Next one. You know Benjamin, number to ninety nine. Kenny Galladay, carry on Johnson in ninety nine.
Little Barry Sanders. 36 out of 199. Two hundred fifty points. Be giving away right here at the end of the break. We got uh, Darnay Holmes. One forty-two out of one ninety-nine. For the G-Men, and then we got for the Packers. So AJ Dillon, nineteen out of ninety-nine. Triple Relic and Auto. And one out of ten, Barry Sanders. Man, getting close again, guys. <laughs> yeah, I know, Thomas. Now, Bossman is doing some drilling. They're almost four out of ten right there. Think of them as kind of similar, Mark. It's just one's gold and one is black. <laughs> he did. Barry did win a Heisman, I believe, but. Uh, it has to be an autograph and it has to be 25 or less so we got the 25 or less we got the Heisman but we didn't get the autograph so this one is guaranteed a one one so someone's gonna get 100 bucks and break credit here 91 out of 99 Hunter Renfro little Julio Jones 24 out of 35 Tony Pollard, 96 out of 99, little patches. We got Len Dawson, 75 out of 99. The one on one printing plate looks like it's going to be for the Steelers. Antonio Brown. Good time to get a one on one. And try to trade, Juan did, the Steelers. And there you go. A little one on one coming your way of Antonio Brown and $100 in break credit. So that's our second bounty hit. coming your way at the end of the break. Jeff decided to pull out right at the end. Back out of the trade. Alright, we got Philip Rivers. Wow, so close. Three out of ten. Man. <laughs> this mixture is just teasing you guys now. Three out of ten. We need four out of ten, guys. I would have got four hundred and ten dollars in break credit for somebody. Or whoever has the the charters. We got uh, Buck Allen, fourteen out of one eighty nine.
we got little Ken, uh, Keen, uh, sorry, Keenan Reynolds, 149 out of 199. Another one for Baltimore and Wesley. And the last one here is a two out of three. Will Fuller, next era patch. That's a rookie as well. Houston, that's going to Sean. We got Von Bell. Number 65 out of 99. Sterling Shepard at 199. We got 23 out of 49, Brandon Marshall. And I believe, guys, um, yeah, I go to the Jets, right? Actually, you know what? I I wanna I wanna ask you. I remember he remembers this. I believe we were to go to the Jets, but I remember. Way back in the day, we had to do a randomizer for it just because it showed both teams. But I'll double check on that. Now we got Jordy Nelson. 25 out of 35. Green Bay Packers going to Wesley. We got Kenny on Drake. One out of fifteen. We got Emmett Smith. Ninety one out of ninety nine. Yeah, Spectre is really nice, right? I think Spectre football's coming out next month, guys. Dallas Clark, 47 out of 99. Little autograph, Lustrious Legends. And we got little Andy Dalton, really. Five, uh, 65 out of 99. All right, last one here. Marcus Mariota, 15 out of 60. We have 71 out of 99, Paxton Lynch. Tyler Lockett. Three out of ninety nine and Brandon Dowdy, forty two out of ninety nine. Mm, I don't know, I'm not thinking that late. Okay, six, it's four, maybe like yeah, six, six on there. I'll let you know. All right, guys, last box, and then we still have the memorabilia jersey and the helmets. But this is the last card box. And uh, I believe, unless any of those are numbered to 25 out of 50, this will be the last time to get a little bounty here. So let's try to hit at least one of the bigger ones. Maybe another 100 bucks. And of course, maybe the 4 out of 10. And this is 2017 Vertex, guys. So chance at Patrick Mahomes rookies. I got David Johnson, Matthew Stafford. We got past and present Zeke Elliott, Lawrence Taylor. Gonna be a randomizer. Little Carson Wentz, Arab Supremacy. 
Terrell Suggs. Or Suggs, sorry, Unbreakable Relic. 34 out of 49. We got Danny Woodhead, 20 out of 49. That is uh, Baltimore Ravens, Wesley. Dell Beckham Jr., Josh Norman, and these will probably just be left or right just to make it quicker and easier. Go on to Freeman. Oh, Carlos Hyde. Samaj P. Ryan, 16 out of 49. All right, last pack, guys. Stafford. Ground control to Laney or DeMarco Murray. You got Ascent. Malik McDowell to 99. And we got Ed Too Tall Jones, 27 out of 49. Did Ed Two Tall Jones potentially you know, number one overall pick, was he? For a cowboy, he, he was a pretty good player. Oh. <laughs> Not a number one overall pick, though, right? He had a bounty. Four years did he play? Uh, 74 or 5, maybe? He's a rookie. Ed Jones was a number one overall pick in 74. Oh, I got that right. Was he a number one overall pick? That's, oh, wait, that is him. Oh, yeah, that is him. That is a number one overall pick. There you go. So, number 50 or less, you guys got it, 49. 75 bucks for the Cowboys. There you go, Daniel. <laughs> we actually hit one. <laughs> there you go, way to look, way to look, way to, way to look at that. He was a former number one overall pick. 1974, Tennessee State, Dallas Cowboys. So there you go. So again, Daniel with the Dallas Cowboys. That's 75 bucks. Well, at least we got an extra one. This was for Cowboys, right? All right. So, hey, still have two more hits to give out. It's a jersey and a mini helmet, but at least we got a third bounty. Just squeezed in there, too, as well. Now, let's do the mini helmet, and then we'll do the jersey. And, again, these will go to whatever team is affiliated on the mini helmet. Unless it's college, then we'll go by college rules. So, like, if we were to hit that redemption of Brady jersey, that looks like it's a Michigan jersey. That'll go to the Buccaneers. Right, we can play a little Who Am I too, guys, if you guys want. Alrighty, so Who Am I, guys? 
I'm a seven-time Pro Bowler, four-time first-team All-Pro, right there. 1963 right there. AP NFL, right NFL uh, MVP, so most valuable player in 1963, three-time NFL passing touchdown leader, 1963 NFL passing rating, uh, rating leader, in the ring of honor, my number 14 jersey is retired, part of the... 49ers Hall of Fame and Pro Football Hall of Fame in 1971 and this uh, player here is not with us anymore born uh, October 24th 1926 uh, passed away on October 18th 2017 so who am I guys old school player right here played for a couple teams Y.A. Tittle. Hall of Fame 71. For the G-Men. Going to Nick. Last one, guys. Little Jersey. This one's actually a current player, guys. Five-time Pro Bowler. Five-time first-team All-Pro. I'm a three-time NFL Defensive Player of the Year. Two-time NFL Sack Leader. Drafted in 2011, 11th overall. Uh, won the 2010 Ronnie Lott Award winner. 2010 First-Team All-American. And 2010 First-Team All-Big Ten. Played collegiate football at Wisconsin and also won the 2014 Burt Bell Award. Pretty good resume for a guy that's been injured a lot of his career. But when healthy, he's one of the most dominant players in the NFL. Not Donald, not Clay Matthews. Tyler, do not doubt yourself. It is him. There you go. Little JJ Watt. <laughs> there you go. There's the auto. Here's the JSA. Nice little red Texans jersey right here. And Houston Texans that's going to Sean. Nice break. I think Sean got himself a nice DeAndre Hopkins rookie jersey auto. And uh, I'm going to say it was like a two out of three he got in Spectrum as well. And that little JJ Watt coming his way. Alrighty, and there you go, guys. Um, so we did hit three bounties. Daniel got number one overall pick under 50. 
Uh, zero number with Ed Tutal Jones, Cowboys number one overall pick. Juan got $100 in break credit for getting a printing play, one of one. And Paul got $100 for getting a printing play, one of one. Uh, we have a couple randomizers to do as well, guys. Uh, we're going to give away 250 points right now to someone in the break. Um, I guess we'll just give these to the teams they will go to. And then, let me give me one second really quick. Just give this one to the Jets. And then I have the quad somewhere in here. And I'll do a little recap as well. I got a quad auto in here or something. A quad relic, I believe. There we go. And then I'll do a little recap as well, guys. Alright, so these three, 250 points. Yes, Evan, it just ended right now. Got to do a couple randomizers really quick. All right, first one, everybody will have a shot at it, so we'll just go by the team, see who gets the 250 points. Next one will be the quad relic. We'll have the Rams. Eagles, Broncos, and Jets. Next one we'll have the Cowboys and Giants. And the last one here we'll have the Giants and Redskins. I roll it, and we got a six to two for eight times. Everybody that shot at this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Washington gets that one. So Adam Coverman gets 250 points. Eight times now here on the quad relic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eagles. Get that quad. Tyler, there you go. Eight times here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Giants. So we'll get down past and present. 
Uh, if they're if they're numbered cards, Jeff. If they're inserts and stuff like that, they will. If they're veteran base, I'm most likely they will not. And then Redskins Giants. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Washington gets that one. All righty, and there you go, guys. So again, we hit three bounties. 100 bucks, 100 bucks, and 75 bucks. A total of $275 being given out in this break. And then a uh, ton of stuff that's going to be top loaded that are numbered in relics right here for you guys. Boom. And a lot of top loaded hits right here as well. That's some Ajay P. Ryan auto, Danny Wood hit patch auto, Dowdy, <coughs> Dallas Clark. Had a couple times where we almost hit the bounty, the big bounty. So you can see right there. Little Michael Thomas redemption. Dwayne Haskins. Not bad right there. This one was the closest. Two out of ten could have almost hit that. DeAndre Hopkins, rookie. Jersey Auto. Two out of three, Will Fuller. This one was really close too. 3 out of 10, I think, is the closest we came. Philip Rivers there, Len Dawson. AJ Dillon in there. If this one would have been under 50 or under 25, we would have hit, like, three bounties here. We would have hit, or two bounties at least. Number one overall pick and Heisman Trophy winner, but still very, very nice there as well there for Jason. The RPA, Kyler Murray. DeAndre Swift was 4 out of 5, so we actually hit the right number here. Just needed a 10 over here. That's still very nice. And Johnny Manziel, a little auto, would have hit the Heisman auto, which needed it out of 25. And a little Marquis good one. I appreciate it, guys. This was the 18 box Jaspies Bounty Hunter Mixer on jaspiescasebreaks.com. So if you look at the website, if you guys want to join in on more of our mixers, basketball mixers down to three. And we're at 13 left in the uh, filler break to help fill it up. Baseball mixes down to five. We have to fill up 15 more spots in the filler. We're getting close, guys. And if you guys want another football mixer, we have a nine box uh, Heisman football mixer where we're giving away a Kyler Murray Optic Auto 910 out of 25 rated rookie. So a little smaller boxes, nice little giveaway, and uh, about $80 a spot cheaper as well since it is like half the boxes. So appreciate you guys. Jazbeescasebreaks.com.